Good morning. The thing that's on my mind this morning is how easy it is to avoid things that we are terrible at. <laughs> and the thing about this is that it keeps us from growing, whether that's in our corporate career or in our businesses. And sometimes we aren't so great at doing something because we just haven't done it in a long time, or maybe it's the first time we've tried. So I'll give you an example. I am a keynote speaker and a workshop facilitator, and I love doing this work. Last week, I was practicing one of my keynotes that I haven't delivered in a while, and y'all, it was terrible. I'm not even kidding. I stumbled, I got frustrated, I had to stop and restart multiple times, and my heart kind of started racing because I have a speaking engagement coming up, and I don't want to be terrible at it. Here's the thing that I know and I fall back into every time. I will get better every single time I practice. And because this particular talk is one I have delivered before, I just haven't done it in several months, I know that with just a few practice runs, I am going to feel really confident and the talk will be fabulous. So if there's something that you are avoid doing because you think you're terrible at it, just like I felt yesterday, just know that it is through practice and just moving forward, doing that thing that you're not great at yet over and over again, that we become experts. Pushing past the fear that we are not going to deliver a perfect product or presentation is the way that we grow our businesses. Nobody is perfect. And the mistakes you make along the way, those are the things that create a more meaningful product or service anyway. So if you have been holding back doing something new or something you haven't done in a while because you're afraid you'll be terrible at it, take a step forward, practice and keep going because stepping into doing those things that are difficult, this is how we rise.